I think the whole trying to do black bedsheet books, it just doesn't seem to work in the apartments that we've been living in. I mean, well, with the amount of money that it takes to actually live here. And our lease is up to, I mean, the whole mold situation that we had last summer. Just, I mean, people get killed almost every other month here. Mm. My parents' health started failing. More and more I've needed to, like, take my dad to the doctor. And then I thought, okay, you know, me and Francie and our animals, if we, like, um, move back into my folks' place and kind of turn the garage into the apartment, and, you know, I used to run black bed sheet from their garage um, originally. A lot of times my dad calls me on the phone to try to uh, figure out how to use his remote control for the TV set. He, every day he forgets. And it's like, uh, I can't keep going across town to, like, show you how to turn on the TV. Now all they have to do instead of calling is just knock on the door. I, I think it's going to save a lot of money. It's going to make me more capable. To, to live up to what I'm supposed to be doing with Black Bed Sheets. Not only is it going to be our home, but it's going to be the home to Black Bed Sheet Studios. And I say studios because we're going to have a lot more space to do a lot more. And, you know, believe me, since about the middle of October, I've been moving just uh, every day, packing stuff up in the car and driving it over there and trying to organize it, and then building this monstrous uh, shed myself that's going to be like a workshop, a green screen room for broadcasting live stuff or, or stuff on YouTube. I did the roofing and the pouring rain the other night. Yeah. I've just been devoting all of my time, and I've had very little time to publish books lately, but I mean, it's all going to be worth it. We have a lot of voices at Black Bed Sheet Books, and uh, our stories um, demand to be heard. So we're starting to actually be to where I want to be with uh, with running a sleekly oiled machine that takes over the world eventually. <laughs> or at least yes, takes over the book industry. By, uh, by January, we should be all settled in. Just the beginning, boy, do we have a lot of work to do. The uh, shed is going to come any minute. And there's the... There's... We're going to move everything in the garage into the shed. We're going to move into the garage. We're going to have a... We still got a little bit. Right. And that is the gate. And the garage. And that is the gate. Pull the string. Pull the string. What are you doing, Nick? Look! Look at 
all the lumber. There's lumber, lumber, lumber. Keep that lumber rolling, rolling all the lumber, lumber time. All the tools. Right, I can't even see what I'm filming now. So, so oh wait. Happy Thanksgiving. The battery's running really low. Oh, you're talking about a ball. No, you're great. Happy Thanksgiving, Art. Thank you. There's the drumstick. Thank you for the drum. Thank you for the drum. Yeah, you're getting a you're getting a piece of rest right now. Come on, Nick, before the battery dies, give her some rest. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's dressing in the turkey. There's the dressing. There's the dressing. And give oh, her some, you. give her some dressing. Mm -hmm. Give her some dressing. This is the dressing. Look at this. Mm -hmm. Yams and mashed potatoes and corn. Is it Thanksgiving? Is it turkey day? <laughs> All right, let me just say, I am thankful for knowing you and for having you in my life.
black widows up in here. There's black widows. I'm not going to come up here to watch movies. I will. I'm not going up but now. Oh, now I see you. You want me to hold the ladder? Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! And this is going to be a wash area. There's going to be a wall here. And then the entrance is going to be like right, right here to come out. And we're going to have kitchen counters here and cabinets. A new way to enter the room. This is our den. And that's our stuff still out there. We're gonna have Christmas dinner. Wow. Oh. You wanna open your present, diddles? <laughs> It's a foot massager. Here's a... Thank you. <laughs> there's my peas. Well... Oh, what did you get? Oh, you got the, um... Yeah, you here. Can you turn it on? Right there? Oh, Mama, you got to get your present. Oh. There's your present. Oh. See, it's a personal single serve blender. You drink from the cup that you blend in, yeah. This is the new house we're moving in in a few days. That's the penguin I got yesterday for Christmas. That's Daddy, that's the awesome thing. I must have been really loud for you. You must turn your sound down just before that part happens. The Christmas tree! It's gonna happen again, watch out, turn your sound down. Okay. And we're moving into a better world. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, there you go.
Open for business. <laughs> cool. Okay. 